Hi hey guys, so I've came across the problem with the uh, diffusion profile uh, looking like this. If you see this really pink, sort of hazy material, it's not like the, sh the shader problem where the whole thing's solid pink, it's a little bit different. This is actually a diffusion profile, they call it. It's for subsurface scattering uh, for skin, namely. So what I've done is I've made up a new diffusion profile. So right click and do create uh, rendering HDRP diffusion profile. Once you've made that, um, you can go to the skin here, and down here it says it's missing. So pop that in there. It might say fix now or something. Uh, there'll be a button appears. Make sure you click that. Uh, but that should fix it. So I'm going to do that for each of these. So the same deal with the eyes. The eyes also use subsurface scattering. So if you go to uh, your eye shader and right click, uh, create <coughs> rendering diffusion profile. I'll obviously update this for this particular package, but if you're missing it, then it's easy to add. So I'm just call it I uh, DP I. And you can mess with the settings later. It just matters that the, the shader itself has these. So there's that fix button, make sure you click that and that will fix those. Okay, so once you have those uh, in place, you can actually play with the, the values of uh, those profiles. So let's just go to the skin to show you what I'm talking about. So if you have a look at the profile of the skin, you can play with these values here. You can see how the subsurface affects what range, what level uh, does the subsurface get through. Uh, you see if it's a thin or thick object, and that changes the, the range a bit as well. The transmission colour, you can make it more pink or red or whatever you want. Um, and there's a few other things for the shininess here. Uh, scattering color can be changed. You can see it can go a bit too extreme when you have it set to a solid color. Um, yeah, this is just the kind of color that gets scattered through it. Um, yeah, and multiplier if you want that. nice effect okay so that's that's pretty much what they do and you can do the same thing for the eyes if you want as well thanks for watching this video hope it helps thanks bye